These are the parts of the ocean floor that have been mapped. You can see that most of it is the coast, and the rest has only been mapped a small amount. So, much of the ocean floor is still unmapped, which leads to us having mapped other planets in a higher resolution than even our own. It's crazy to think that we know more about other planets than the one we live on. So, today I'll try to explain why and also the benefits that would come from mapping the ocean floor. First off, the benefits. The ocean floor changes the climate a lot, so it would be helpful to know more about what it looks like. It could also help us know where and when tsunamis will strike. So, mapping the ocean would be very helpful. In fact, some people have died because we don't yet know what's under the water. In 2005, the USS San Francisco submarine crashed into a mountain that was under the ocean. This definitely proves that mapping the ocean floor would be helpful. So, why haven't we done it yet? Well, the ocean is big, deep, and there's a bunch of water in it. Actually, other planets are easier to map than Earth just because of this. To map Mars, they use technology called the Laser Altimeter. This tech is unusable on Earth because of the oceans. Also, you would have to do it by boat, which would be very slow. Most parts of the ocean that have been mapped are near the coast, simply because of the amount of people who are always mapping it. Now, I know this doesn't seem quite good, but it won't be like that for long. There's a project called Seabed 2030 trying to map the entire ocean before 2030. They will have many ships so that it doesn't take too long, and they'll explore all of the ocean that hasn't been explored yet. So, eventually the ocean will be mapped. Anyways, that's why the ocean floor hasn't been mapped. If you guys like this video, then you should check out my second channel where I have more geography content, and I also have a Discord server. Anyways, thanks for watching!